Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to North Country Off Grid. Today, we're getting into that box right there. I figured uh, it's been eight days since we've had the swarm. This was a brand new box with nothing in it and I thought it would be interesting to show you guys how much can get done in a week with a new hive of bees. So guys, if you would, before we get started, please hit the subscribe button if you're new to the channel and if you hit that bell icon, it'll give you notifications whenever we put out new videos. If you guys wanna keep up with what's going on with the bees or the rest of the farm, make sure you're subbed. If you enjoy this video, smash the like button. Let's get started. in the bottom of every single one of those cells just about is an egg and then a bunch of pollen storage over here on the other side and you can see they're drawn out so all of these frames were just a blank frame a week ago so that tells me and there's just one egg in every single every single cell I mean every single one if there's not pollen in it there's just an egg in it so that tells me there's there should be at least a queen in here laying like crazy doing a good job and then I believe the liquid you can see in the top corner there's a clear liquid you can see in that top corner there's a clear liquid in there I believe that's just sugar water uh, we've been feeding them sugar water Okay, and then this entire frame, you've got some pollen storage up around the tops, uh, right along the outside, and there's an egg in every single one of those as well. So every cell there has an egg. So this, uh, this hive was a split coming off of a, a swarm with nothing in it, and now in here in probably two weeks time, that's all gonna be kept brewed and we'll be, uh, we'll be doubling in size. On the opposite side, we've got the same thing going on. Uh, in every single cell is an egg, tiny little egg. So there is a busy, busy queen in here. Okay, you can see on this side, You can see on this side we've got a ton of larvae. They're starting to cap some brood. Um, advanced stages of larvae though. And then pollen up around the edges. On the reverse side of that frame There's quite a bit of um, larva in very beginning stages, very small, about the size of rice. 
So young larvae. So it looks like they went all the way to the left side of the box and started moving inward. Okay, last frame. So on the very outside, they're still drawing, drawing comb out pretty good. There's some, there's some pollen in that one. And on the inside of that frame is a ton of pollen. All right guys, so there you have it. There is a week's worth of work there for those, um, or from those bees. Now we have fed, in the top we've been feeding sugar water, and we had fed them two gallons of sugar water uh, in the eight days uh, since they swarmed. We fed them that night, uh, came back and checked, and it was empty, fed them again, and then hadn't touched it until today. So uh, two gallons of sugar water in eight days. And then also I noticed that their comb is very white and looking down in the bottom of their hive you see uh, sugar crystals basically and uh, it looks like if you feed them a lot of sugar water they have extremely white comb. If you found that to be true with your bees uh, let me know in the comment does what they eat, what they consume, determine the color of their comb. Well guys, we got four more hives to go through, so I'm going to leave you guys here, check out the rest of my hives, but I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I was pretty surprised by how much work they had gotten done. Very surprised by how much, how many eggs have been laid by the queen already. Uh, there were tons of eggs, tons and tons of eggs. Uh, she must have came in here the first day, uh, almost, and started laying because there's already pretty advanced larva, so. Uh, exciting, so this hive should be taken off. They've got plenty of room to grow in this bottom super. Uh, so it's gonna be a while before we go up But we got plenty of time left in the summer for them to grow and be a, a successful hive All right guys. Thanks for watching make sure you subscribe and hit the bell if you want to follow along and see how this hive does This hive is also gonna need a name